hey 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 welcome back to my channel today i'm bringing to you another interesting one this is the rye plantain fritters now if your plantain turns black you don't have to throw them away you can still use them for something without wasting time let me show you so here i've got some ingredients i've got some onions i've got a little bit of garlic i've got some red chili pepper i've got some ginger i've got some anise seeds and finally i've got about four or five pieces of cloves what i'm going to do is i'm going to blend everything up and here i've got my overripe plantain as you can see i have three medium sized ones I'll go ahead wash them and peel them Now I'll add the spices and with the help of a blender, I'll blend it into a very smooth mixture. So as you can see, it's been blended very well and I love this consistency. Now I blended the cloves and the anise separately, so I'll just drop it into it. I'll add a little bit of salt to taste. And with the help of my spoon, I'll mix everything up. Next, I'll come in with about two tablespoonful of flour and I'll mix it up very well. I'll put a pan on fire and come in with some oil. When the oil is hot enough and with the help of a spoon, I'll drop in the mixture. I'll let them fry till it turns golden brown and you should be turning them occasionally. So as you can see, it is golden brown now, it is ready, I'll just get them out of the oil. So ladies and gentlemen, our plantain fritters is ready. As you can see, it was so effortless, it's easy and very quick to make. This can be eaten with bean stew or it can be eaten like that. They are so delicious and you can't stop at one. So I hope I did help you and I hope you are going to give this a try. If you do, let me know how it comes out for you. If you've not subscribed, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to share this with family and friends and don't forget to leave me that big fat thumbs up. Until next time, I am going to see you again with another nice and interesting one. Bye bye.